Hi Twin Flames, welcome back, welcome if you're new, my name's Sophia, um, <laughs> I just want to say, I say, sorry, that my, uh, my little one, oh she's not little, but, uh, Yanka posted yesterday, new moon in Leo, and Leo's to do with the portal, Leo is the strength card, Leo is connected with, um, Twin Flames, because Leo is to do with, uh, sexual energy, I call it in my deck, and, um, and I think there's actually four moons out and there's normally like three or something like that. That's why it's so important at this time. Um, I actually remembered <laughs> um, the prediction of this global change of events now was in Pisces and Neptune about two years ago. So whenever Pisces, and it's like 15 degrees, I know I don't want to go too much into it. That's when global, the planets make massive um, changes on Earth. So, um, no, uh, they know all this. If you're interested in planets and astrology, like the brilliant Andrea Carter, hi Andrea, um, divine sis, I think, sorry if it's divine, one of the divines, both of the divines on the, all the people on the playlist, uh, uh, subscription, this is amazing, but, um, they know, they know, and they are the elite secret society, knows about the planets, knows about the universal laws, that's why they, they're called the elite, elite is kind of quiet, the secret, the Illuminati is the illuminated one, the illuminated one in tarot is the magician card, they know how to manifest, the magician card is all the alchemical elements, they know about um, the Kabbalah, the tree of life, the laws of the planet, the planets, they know about all that, that's how they're at the top, you know, that's why they do the pyramid in the eye, they all see an eye, they know about insight as within, so without, they know it all, anyway, I wasn't supposed to say that, so I wanted to say, go to y oh, Yanka, probably knows all that, so go to Yanka, um, Twin Flame in Union on my subscription list, she's just done a video, I haven't watched it yet, got to get my cup of tea ready, I'll post and get my cup of tea list ready, listen to any videos from the kids, so I've got Yanka and I've got Joey. I released a video yesterday, very, 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 very important. I'm um, pulling back from doing more chat videos. That one needed to be said because most of you don't understand or have some kind of excuse. So as I, as uh, my parents died, that's why I didn't have to confront them. I had to visualize them in reality today. People say the past, um, you can't do nothing about the past. Yes, you can. That's why we have the imagination. I had to visualize them today, how I would speak to them if they were alive about how my upbringing was fuckeries. There's no excuse because I used, oh, they passed over, so I didn't have to do it. And then when I was like, and then my other excuse was, well, they would just argue with me and, and they wouldn't give me an answer I needed or they would just go, what you want about or they would ignore me. This doesn't matter. You have to release it. It's that important. I might put an extra, record a video and put it in the master program because most don't do that. They think it's just the inner work. Inner work is fucking massive. Yes. But there's about uh, releasing that as well. Um, you're putting that burden back onto the people who created it. I'm not saying, I just want to make this clear. I'm not saying it's their fault, but come on now. Most of us twin flames don't repeat the patterns from what our parents do. So what was wrong? All right, I, I got about that in the master program. They didn't have the internet. They didn't have like a community. I get it. But still, you, it's not for you to hold any burdens or, or, or you were not created to hold other people's burdens. So, okay, let's jump here. Let's see what's going on. Oh, uh, oh I'll use my cards for a couple of days. Um, they're not out yet. Um, I've still got one, my, um, fluff cards, I called them, Answers from the Hidden Realm will be released in about two, three weeks, no, sorry, Answers from the Hidden, hidden Realm, I might be, uh, getting next week, but, the, um, and then two, three weeks, Alien Oracle cards, they're all going to be sold together, I might sell them separately, but I'm trying to do a training school, so you know how I do, if you like how I do cards, I want to give you everything. This community, on my channel, on my, I, I give you everything I know, everything I know. And I channel from 5D, the Twin Flame contract. So this one is gangster, isn't it? Um, all C and I, illuminated one, that's why I picked this one with the eye, you see. 
if you like the artwork, Fran, oh, a website. See, I didn't even know. Culture Fix and whatever's. Anyways. Okay, uh, yeah, anyways, um, yeah, I didn't name anything. I thought I should have called it um, <laughs> Bad Boy Cards or uh, Quan and Joey Cards. <laughs> Let's jump in because he's a gangster. Uh, all right, I'll take them because I'll pre shuffle, you see. Yeah, with the four moons instead of three moons or something like that. That's why this portal's dragging on. Everything that's going on is divinely timed. <clears throat> Everything in life is divinely timed. If you don't believe that, when people say, oh, I wish I didn't, you know, I, I wish I left sooner. I wish I didn't um, stay in this, give so much money, give so much love. I wish I didn't, I wish I didn't. Now, you lot watch other tower readers. How can it be that all of us resonate for one star sign at the same time? Because it's divinely timed. So never think that whatever you've done was not right. Everything is for purpose and reason on this planet. So if this time with this portal and you're feeling, oh, I shouldn't have done this, I shouldn't have done that, you know, no. Because if that's so, then you wouldn't resonate with so many. All of us have done it at the same time because the planets, if you then go into the planets, um, help you to move along so now everything is divinely timed so and look i've got about the sciences there wheel of fortune planets 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 this is like i said divinely timed oh look it come out as well it freaked me out it freaks me out when we do that all oh. okay let's jump in I'm missing one. I need another one. <clears throat> one more. I normally get six. Let's put it here so you can see. Right. See? Talking about the science. This is to do with uh, Mercury. Mercury, yeah. <laughs> Mercury is a uh, well, whoops. <laughs> Mercury is um, uh, communication. I, um, I think it's retrograde, but it doesn't matter. It's about um, communication. Mercury is um, also Gemini and Virgo. Sorry, I forgot then. Which is uh, the the um, Gemini is the twins, the lovers, the lovers twice here. You both, it's mutual love. You're not feeling this at the moment. Getting that a lot this week. You're not feeling that your person is interested in you uh, or there's something. Towers hit twice, right? Dark Knight is a soul, death cards, all that this week because of portals, like I said. And you at the moment, there's something that's happened, right? Regardless if there's a communication not happening or there's some event, even if you're not speaking with your person, there's a change that's happened with most, it's a, a particularly in Twin Flames, right? That is a change that's needed a new cycle with the, where is it, the wheel here, wheel of fortune, new so cycle is needed. See, this is a science, science is um, quantum physics, this is the Six of Swords, right? Um, I called it science. Um, this is about her pushing it forward and can you see how the the moon the moon look how massive the moon is oh this is the um aquarius aquarius age as well here yeah. but this i was saying this is the um, Mer mercury communication like i said there's something ugh, they're telling me it's a communication of the planets some of you may be um getting some to, to telepathic communication as well now Telepathic communication, I don't really, um, I remember one time someone sent me a video and said, look, look at this channel, she's really good, she has telepathic communication. We're not here to have telepathic communication with our twin flame, because we might as well have stayed up in 5D, you know, you know, not, 
well, you know, how it rolls. We're supposed to be learning how to live off this beautiful planet and tell others how to do it, not go up into 5D. Some of you are so third dimensional, some of you just stay up in 5D. You're supposed to have an equal balance. That's why the balance card is on the top of the tree of life behind the magician card or one, I don't know which one's in front or they're together, I don't know. But my point is, because you're supposed to find the equal balance of the negative and positive, hence um, yin and yang in the back of the card. I won't go into that now. That's on my PDF of why I got it with the fishes and stuff. But it's, um, it's about swimming up screen uh, against the current and, you know, up and down the current. It's the back of the cards. Look, judgment. Wait the fuck up, card. Anyway, so this card is a science. This is about pushing it forward, moving forward. Um, see, she's not looking very happy, really. Look, grabbing a, a cup here. Um, cup of love. Trying to love herself, feeling, trying to do the inner work, kind of thing like that. But the moon is really making you guys emotional at this time. Um, and yeah, Mercury communication something about communication but with the planets communicating to you and i said telepathic oh yeah we're not supposed to be telepathic communication and they say it's from 5d but um upstairs them lot i don't know what to call it you know source right um there's no communication up there it's knowing you just know what they're saying that's why i don't really agree with it but i'm not saying that it doesn't happen because Obviously, we're on third dimension, and if you're getting telepathic communication of sorts from your person, then it will be in word form kind of thing, because we're 3D. Ace of Swords. Yes, look, communication. Absolutely, communication. What's happened here? And in my aces, all the aces have, uh, I told her to put earth, air, water, fire in all the, um, all the um, aces. So that's why the fire is coming off the sword. The sword here, there's the earth and the water. Because all the aces are when you manifest a new beginning. So I told her to put it in the cards. So this is about, um, um, with this card coming out, this is an um, ace of swords with um, your person because it's fire. And fire is obviously twin flame. So there's some kind of communication. See, with this six of swords, it's like you may have had her off. You've cut, this is what the planet is doing, cutting something out. To have a new start, right, in truth, with the sword here, the new start in the truth. Um, who is it? I think Federica says she liked this card, and I said uh, this is connected with the, how the box looks and the cards looked. This was my favourite image, one of, one of them anyway. So this is about um, balancing out. Look, ship again. Told her to put the ship in there. Um, it's juggling. It's about um, you, feminine here. Told her to, and once again, I said um, to put the yin and yang in this because the two of pentacles is, you know, up and down, juggling, um, all that kind of stuff. And it's, it's the two of pentacles means to to me, obviously my deck, to balance out the juggling of your masculine and feminine, your yin, your yang. Right. This is temperance. Temperance is about balancing the hot the cold making a uh, that one um and this is also connected with jupiter as well which is your person so balancing out your masculine and feminine with your person uh, i said put all the alchemical elements because of is connected with um to me with the i just said the name temperance card and that is control saturn so trying to control your yourself here because it's a feminine right and not worry about your ships coming in that's why i've called it balance balance is about um trying to get balance in in this when you're you're thinking maybe it's um but this is happening with your person because of they're now changing to get into the more feminine self and you you may be noticing well not necessarily but you are more masculine now because generally the feminine, the, the, in Twin Flames, cups are the feminines. Well, it's not, it cups are the feminines, right? And um, we are the more emotional one, right? And they're more of the swords, which is, it's no point even talking to them about logic. I know, up in air. But um, this is a change now. So this is balancing out 
the imbalance of the masculine feminine because you're now becoming more masculine and they're becoming more of their emotional they're not non-emotional they don't express it due to some reason right which there's several reasons <laughs> in my playlist probably has loads of them so underneath this one which is the ships coming in right and you um want in your love loving yourself trying to do the inner work not sure wanting to push things forward right but this is um divinely timed this is go within and tap within your um because this is the i've told her to put the 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 like the original wide awake deck I told her to put the uh this words letters there it is <laughs> letters of tarot around the wheel of fortune which is in the original wide awake because this is connected to intuition knowing right because god is tarot is the high priestess you guys are the high priestess knowing that this is divinely timed knowing that this is is, is happening right these are all to do with all the alchemical elements as well once again this is Jupiter, your person. This is divinely timing to put in um, things in, in motion with your person. And um, look, masculine at the top there. See him there? Mr. Gangster or Mrs. Gangster, whatever you want to call it. So knowing that this is um, moving forward and you move forward on your um, mission as well, going forward into mission. Um, look, centre focus here. It's definitely some of you have had an off, right? Um, why? Bush, you guys, the lovers here. Yeah. Look, this is, can you see, I've told her to do black and white. It's not only because there's no colour. There's no, look at me and my son. Well, uh, <laughs> galactic son, <laughs> Joey, right? There's no colour. There's no, right, there shouldn't be. This is just an avatar body, a suit. I call it right so but this I said to her make it like black and white because this is that once again the yin and the yang is very important for me because it's about that's why most of the Star Wars and Star Trek and all these um, gal uh, what is it things of the galaxy of the mr. Tim Green something got something of the galaxy um, and all those films have a black and a white couple because they know i'm telling you they know what's going on in the world about the balance you know the infinite stone with um marvel or, or whatever the other one is Do you know they all know there's always a black and white couple in there and it might not be together but there's a main character that represents the black and the white of the lovers of this planet's frequency of love they know that. Even she's green, it don't matter, in the Guardians of the Galaxy. There's another one with black and white. I can't remember. Who am I thinking? Oh, I can't remember. But anyway, so this is balancing out the, the yin and the yang. That's what I meant with the black and white. Can you see the edge? I told her to put, like, the hands, the feeling frequency from upstairs. This is divinely puppeted from upstairs. Once again, this is this is a lot about upstairs. Look source hand from source divinely timed moon card upstairs don't worry whatever's happened is meant to be it's in general anyway but more so at this time with the twin flame like i said with the aquarius age it's aquarius ages where look gemini the twins i was saying about gemini the twins look cupid loves the arrow children be your child this is getting you both to be like um your childlike self now i think i'm presuming yeah can you see he's holding the cup of love i told you there's a switch around he's holding it now and she's going with it you go within because the black is the the um the the yin which is the feminine which um the feminine is the internal emotions the yang is the um, outside, which is, that's why they know about the planet, the Illuminati. The outside is the masculine. They always want to get their foundation up, right? The, the, so, But this is, she's going within, knowing that he's going to be grabbing that cup of love. 
and his eyes are wide open now. It's a wake-up call, I said, with the judgment card here. I'll show you that. I'll leave that gangster. Waking up, right? This is also, children to me represent maturity, wising up and maturing now as well. <clears throat> this one is one, two, three, four, five, six. I didn't always put the thing. I thought, oh, I'll make them big so they can count. Balance. What have I been saying? Eagle, is it six? Yeah. Balance. Balancing out this situation. The imbalance. Look, it's underneath the balance card. Two balance. It's balancing out what? The yin, the yang, the imbalance. Whatever the situation of your situation is imbalanced. Well, uh, let's be fair, it's quite a lot and generally, just saying. But whatever the imbalance is, is being balanced by the planets at this particular time. This is about you knowing that. And I feel that you lot know that. It's just the unseen. But you have to, we are here to tell people, well, that's how life is. You have to trust upstairs in source. You can't see source. You have to trust energy. You have to trust the science. This is what this is about here. <coughs> this is like, yeah, you having crumbs, you see? And, and balancing out with the scales here, your person. This is becoming equal balance absolutely becoming a balance on top of balance that's interesting and like i said underneath is a judgment wake up call this is um oh which one is it healing love angel is it uh gabriel or michael because I, I i told her to make this card off after the ride awake so look waking up um to um and are they all masculine aren't they masculine's waking up there's so many 78 cards man i can't remember all the definitions but look yeah um coming out of the grave and yesterday's reading was it's interesting with the grave which i forgot to say was the four swords and he was lying in the grave it looks like he was dead you know, he was in the church, he looked like in the coffin, that's the rebirth, that's the death card, and this is once again the rebirth, the death card, the transformation, the change, it's absolutely a transformation with the masculines at this time, and same with you, right, from understanding, hold on, what the fuck, I'm, I'm following belief systems and stuff that's not mine, may or may not have worked with my family i'm following that and i'm not happy that's what's happening here that's what's happening and you lot need to understand that's what was that's why they're imbalanced was it's not that they're mean they're horrible that's why i don't ugh, okay i won't say that well it's true oh, i still can't say it other tower readers they don't like me cussing anybody <laughs> but i swear um <clears throat> They give their own opinion. And how do you know it's their own opinion? Because when they say something like this reading, oh, there's, look, there's two imbalance here, so you're getting crumbs. Fuck him off. Fuck her off. They don't say, source says to fuck him off, do they? They say, oh, get rid of him. But they never say, source says to that, because source would never say that. Never, ever, because it's your opinion of something. So when they, that's what you have to look for. When they say, yeah, well, I, you know, source is telling me God or thank you, guiding angels and blah, blah. So you lot get pulled in. Oh, she's channeling. She's channeling. But then they say, oh, don't take crumbs. Hold on. Did source say that or did she say that? That's what you have to define. You see, because the source will never tell you to get rid of fucking anybody. Then they, but you think, oh, they're clever because they, but, but there's a difference. Speaking opinion and then speaking from sources, two different things. It's what you've got to see in uh, tarot readings, I'm just saying. So the underlying factor is judgment card. This is um, being judged, um, you know, judgment call, um, make it, you know, making that judgment call. This is what your person's doing. And this is what, because you was doing, you know, da, 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 the wake up call. And coming out of this uh, route, it, Going back, back to what they wish, their desires. Like I said, the children and maturing. These look like grown-ass men. Maturing, in it? It's not children, it's grown-ass man. So, man or woman, they're waking up. the masculines, kind of thing. So, um, 
I'll clarify with these ones <coughs> so you get to see these cards. Like I said, they're not out for sale yet. They'll only be sold by the children. Now, if you're new and you don't know who they are, um, check out everything, all videos, um, and in the I might have to put them separate on the features list when the cards are sold so everyone can know and when 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 um i'm going to give all children um in the community if you're new the cards to sell so when and when they've sold they can tell me and i'll remove them from the features so you can go to the next one that kind of thing do you see what i mean when one person so it's equally um everyone gets equal amount now if the children are listening some of you get less cards than the others because some of you I'm helping you different ways. So I'm just saying. When all kids, how much I give them their cards are sold, then I'll sell it. I, I, I'm not selling it separate now. I'm not feeling that. This is about teaching. These cards are for twin planes and for soulmates. Because the definitions within the cards are for soulmates. We are here to teach the soulmates. So I was going to say twin flame, and I thought, nah, because of I've get, I'll give you a PDF with the definitions of how I'm talking about the cards, with every single detail. I can't go into that. Uh, this will be hours long, but so that you know how I talk about the cards, and then you pull out what you feel relevant at this time for the definition. But if I went into every de definition of what I created with Fran with these uh, BF rages, but you get that when you buy this. But obviously, so you know that definition for twin flames, but then you can still use the um, the, the yin and the yang and the, 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 you know, the Capricorn and the alchemical elements to teach for the soulmates if you so choose. That's why I should, like I said, I should have called it, I, I don't know what to call it, I didn't know. So, but, hey, tarot, it is what it is on the box, tarot cards. <laughs> so anyway, let's get a couple more, I'll do um, any, anything else. Oh, I like that card. It's um, it's us lot. Yep, it's definitely yep, yep, yep. And I was saying about that. What's this one? Oh, gee, come on now. Well, I only waited five minutes. Us lot up in air. It's really nice. This card, isn't it? Look, kundalini caduceus so you lot should be doing that the acorn is about birthing something as well this is a uh, where is it where is it queen of wands um taming that reptilian not to react because there's two swords that's come out here this one um is not too aggressive like um alistair crowley's card that you see it looks like it's ready to pounce so it's looked like you are actually more chilled at the moment <laughs> Right about the situation, you're taming your reactions back, Queen of Wands here, right? But still feeling your person, right? Uh, still kind of um, pissed off, maybe some of you with fire around the head here, but still. Which one came out next? Oh, see, look, this one, transformation of the butterflies around your person. Sword is up, in his truth, but look, stuck on the rock. It's on the rock, but look, all the emotions are here, right? Thinking. Uh, where is it? King of Swords, right? This is logic, logically planning. This is with his thought form now, his or her. I feel with this card, with the butterflies here, right? This is also looks like a kind of grave to me. Um is understand it and logicate in his next plan of attack from once again the judgment call that's what i've and that's what logic is to logicate plans and strategies of what you want but most people just logicate or uh, uh, think of something and and they just they get stuck on the logic i'm like no 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 you can always change your mind that's what they do it but the heart is set of what you really want your heart's desire so this is, well, let's bring this out. These lot now. Heartbreak. Obviously, right? Both of you. Because not in the truth. The sword down and indecisive behavior. This is sorting out the heart. I said to her, make it like a mirror. And, it, and in fact, both of you in heartbreak at the mo moment now. 
you see the shattered glass it's like the broken um it's broken at the moment but it's being put back together um the two swords are being up which is um about how you both shield your heart and that was like you shield your heart from your friends and family right from the wrong they done so your person shields their, their heart but you're like well i don't shield it to him shield the heart shield the heart <laughs> that's what i'm saying you lot just don't you you get to the nitty gritties it's like it's either or that's why i got the yin and yang in this card because most don't understand that if your person's shielding their heart from you which is a code emotionally unavailable which is heartbreaking right what are you shielding your heart to that's it most of you try to figure out well you know I, who, who, you know he does this this way so what am i doing that way as well it's not it's pretty simple when you get down to the nitty gritties you're both in heartbreak at the moment this is being balanced out it's that way up sorry right and this is what else um this is what star sign is that uh it's not star sign what planet Hold on, hold on, hold on. I can't remember. So I put all these symbols in, but I can't remember. Who knows this? What is this? Oh, there it is. Saturn controlling, controlling your heart. Oh, sorry, this one it needs to be balanced out. Both of you. Wicked card. Uh, I've already talked about that manifesting Illuminati elite Illuminati. Look, is that is that Capri is Mercury again? Communication. I don't know if the the, the portal to do with the communicate. No, at this time, okay. Yep. All right. Yeah, magician card, Egyptian. I like it. I said, look, do it a bit Egyptian because you know we got a load of Egyptian hi history. That's why Yanka. I love her channel. She goes into the history of the Twin Flames, right? And the yellow with the sun of the healing, all the alchemical elements on the table. I said to her to put them down there, right? As above, so below. I said, put the wand because it's relevant for Twin Flames in the hand. Can you see? Um, this one. This is um, defeat. He's, you see, he's getting the strength. Being tough here, it looks like I said, make him a tough man in this one, right? To um, battle out all, all the seven of wands is being defensive, but make him be victorious, I said to her. So I said, we've got to make him strong, get the strength to do this, right? So this is him trying to get the strength to battle things, to be victorious. And this is against other people who are passionately telling him what to do, the six wands underneath. Um, where did I can't remember the deck um but anyway so i was trying to tell you who um i got the things from this is a valor which is um facing danger because he doesn't like to face any sort of it's not really danger but to him it's like or her you know going against people because they like to keep the they they would prefer to be unhappy just to keep the peace with other people. This is this card. Battling against it. Right? And to him, it's a bloody battle. That's what, or her, it's a battle. But he's doing it. That's what this is doing. And once again, that is Mars with the Emperor. So he's trying to control his world. Um, that's long. First house, which is himself. Trying to control himself. And the death card, Scorpio as well. Which is eighth house, which is to do with... Um, deep secrets which is um being in his truth and telling him the truth so that's interesting with this card here bad man <laughs> lastly um this one which is this one is oh three of wands this is about going forward in life going for what you want moral excellence this is i would think is about um you because it looks to me about in the woods right um this is about releasing your person. Can you see she's letting it, um, the bird go? This is um, this is three of wands. Look, two of wands here. 
going down the correct path, which is two, 11 and 11 is the paths. So 11 is um, the two ones here is the pathway to twin flames and one in her hand here, the path. This is sun, but it's also consciousness, which is the science pushing things forward as well. And this is Aries, which is the um, first health. This is about you. So this is about you going down the correct path with healing on the tree of life in the woods, which is wisdom, because the wisdom to me is the tree, the tree of life. I've got the cards with in the woods are the um, Virgo, which the Hermit's card. So he is, is um, gathering wisdom by yourself, singularly, right? And the wisdom is you have to let your person go because this free will experience is about free will. So at this time, with all these cards, is is like you'll release your person because there's some off, she don't look too happy, yeah, there's something that you don't like, right, something's happened, I already said that, but you've released your person, and you're seeing if they're going to come back, right, um, correct, you know, there's some stability that's happening here, there's a massive change, with the kind of, um, there's a change that's going on in it, I like this guy, it's quite different to the other set, so that's it, um, oh, see, long reading. So, um, yeah, let's go check out Yankers, Twin Flame um, University. Now, I'm going to do that. Well, I'm going to make a cup of tea and listen to, because she's got about the moon in Leo, and that's affecting us at this moment. Okay, so speak to you later.